Today on Logan Lee Adventures. I've been all about relaxation in the Gilly Islands and dabbling into a higher transcendence with magic mushrooms is on my list. But first, morning guys. So we just finished our morning yoga. What did you think? <laughs> um, okay, personally, I'm not a big fan of yoga. Yeah. <laughs> but it was just, it was relaxing being next to the beach. Like, yeah, we heard the waves, the waves coming and, in. Yeah. I was, nice. I was struggling. I had to take my shirt off and like because I was sweating so much like the shirt was It's, it's dry now <laughs> But it was now I feel relaxed and yeah. I think it's the, it's the same thing as like if I was going to the gym in the morning and Working out I would feel relaxed afterwards anyways. Yeah, I think it just like sets you up for the day and Yeah, for the rest yeah. Of the day. so we're here at Pachamama Organic Cafe and we just we've got bikes for the day so we bicycles this time so no more injuries <laughs> you never know yeah you, know, you actually never know these bikes these bicycles are a and little these roads aren't the best yeah either. they're like all sandy after pachamama steph and i got into a groove of well doing nothing and it's the best we alternated between swimming a bit in the ocean and in my case splashing myself a little so the salt water doesn't sting my scarred foot <laughs> and just eating more food look at this yumminess but then as we were laying in our cabana on the beach we stumble upon this mythical magic mushroom shake what is it well the gilly island has a reputation for many things and one of them is to expand your mind with hallucinating drugs that come in a form of unnatural hand-picked mushrooms organic it smells like Oh, don't apple? tell me it smells like that. No, it smells okay. like apple. <laughs> like very fruity. Which is surprising because the water is like murk the juice is murky green with lots of foam on top. Hmm. Okay, we'll see. Okay. Now we have to sit together. Okay. Ready? Ready? Okay. Ready? Okay. Tastes interesting. It's very smoky. You can definitely taste fungi. Like, mm. you know like the, the taste of mushroom, like it's very yeah. mushroomy. <laughs> I don't know what to expect. <laughs> Are we meant to finish the whole thing? Like right away? Or I think so. Sip it? <laughs> no, I think I have to finish like the whole thing. Yeah. <laughs> we stir it. Okay. It's 4.23 p.m. And the sun is just... So close! 4.23? Yeah. yeah. Why can't we put it in a better tasting shape? I don't know. Because you know I mean? <laughs> like the actual shroom is like, like little... it should be like kind of tasteless. You know? Yeah. And if you mix it with like a smoothie, that would be really nice. Yeah, that would be really nice. Why don't you just put it in my coconut shake? I keep expecting to feel something different like right away. Me too. But and then obviously, it, no, yeah. like, it shouldn't hit you. Obviously, like it's... Half, yeah, half an hour. In. Yeah. It's making its way through intestine. My into my bloodstream. <laughs> yeah, body is absorbing it. I'm still waiting for. Uh, yeah. I actually no expectations. I don't know. I've never been on hallucinogens before, so this is like one of those like last tapes that people find. Yeah. <laughs> um, if I do anything really really stupid. No, it, it's my fault. <laughs> <laughs> My emergency oh, contact is my boyfriend. You been... It's your last tape, so called. <laughs> You're kind of gone. <laughs> well, no, not like should a we, last. Should last we write if I just got to go? <laughs> you know how in some places it's like, oh, if you're lost, you know, write your hostel name and yeah. write your number. Like, right. Wait, do you feel that, or is this me? Like my mind is like, Apple. like I can feel a tickle in my mind. No. Is this placebo? <laughs> I think so. You expect the thing to happen. Yeah. Can we give it 10 minutes? Yeah, definitely give it 10 minutes. We'll see. Just a little update. It's been 20 minutes. Or a little bit over 20 minutes. And just relaxing. I don't think I feel anything yet. What about you, Steph? Yeah. So 20 minutes in. So it's been an hour and. I really don't feel anything. <laughs> anything feels sleepy because I didn't take a nap today, but other than that, there's nothing. 
Um, I did get hives. I don't know if you can see the bumps on my skin, just above my tattoo. <laughs> so I got hives and started getting high because I'm allergic to cats and there was a cat that was roaming around our little beach pad. It's actually just sitting chilling right there now. But other than that, completely normal. The sun is setting now. It's, it's looking nice with the clouds. Guys, so it obviously didn't fucking work. <laughs> An hour and 40 minutes. An hour and 40 minutes. I think we so topped. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> the, yeah, we kind of topped the record for longest wait time to feel hallucinogens, if anything. Anyways, to make up for it, we are watching a incredibly beautiful sunset. I always thought that clouds add more drama to sunsets. Uh, this sunset is kind of behind the, the sun is kind of behind the clouds right now. So another 40 minutes went by and we definitely did not feel anything. We spent the rest of the night chilling sober just as we started the day. Well, still, I'm glad we got to try it out for ourselves. It's always better worth knowing than always wondering. Well, that's it for my Indonesian adventures. Give this video a like and leave a comment below. Tomorrow, I fly out to Hong Kong. So tune in to the next video by subscribing.